Some of the earliest iterations of the wing aircraft were attempting actually to minimize the number of propellers that we were using by reusing the two systems for both hovering flight and cruise flight. We always knew that we wanted to mix vertical hovering and takeoff with a rapid forward flight which needed a wing and our earliest designs actually tried to reduce the number of motors to the bare minimum possible and we found it was just very difficult to make that concept work. So then we moved to having two different propulsion systems, one solely responsible for hovering and lift and the other responsible for moving the airplane forward. And our earliest prototypes of that had looked very much like a conventional drone with a wing on it. And they performed pretty well, but they were bigger than they need to be. And we also learned that redundancy in that vertical lift propulsion system is really critical. We wound up with the drones that we currently have in service right now, which have both types of propulsion system and effectively like a triple redundant hover propulsion system in each quadrant.